sugar toast. This is dire. If the creature has grown as big as they say... No, no, no. That's impossible. It was such a tiny little thing. Then again, after a hundred years, all bets are off. <gasps> but that would mean it's... <laughs> oh, please. What am I saying? It's not my fault. I am far too fetchingly adorable to make a mistake. Bungling is not in my vocabulary. And yet, the problem remains. I suppose I could take care of it alone. But why face a menace to Tsul? When the world is full of willing meat shields. <sighs> nice. <gasps> you there, young man. Don't you cut a rugged figure. Not too rugged, mind you. People drowning in their own muscles are so distracting. But those vanilla good looks of yours should help guide the eye toward the adorable main act. Yours truly. Oh yes, you'll do just fine. Let's say we join forces and help a few people out. Um, help them how? <gasps> you haven't heard? There's a dreadful monster that's taken up in a cave east of town, down by the shore. What kind of dreadful monster? Oh, uh, it's... Uh, <coughs> well, from what I hear, once upon a time, some incredibly talented sorcerer was conducting an experimental ritual. But confound it, he left behind the raw lens he was using, and, uh, actually, what I mean is the experiment went awry entirely on its own and birthed a creature of pure nightmares. Okay. And we can't have that, now can we? People are too afraid to even take their boats out. Don't you want to help? Doing a good deed is simply the best feeling. Not to mention all the pats on the back you'll get. From the air about you, I thought you'd jump at the... Yes, I'm in. I love helping people. Let's do it. That's the spirit, Schnookums. If only all your peers were so eager. Shall we depart forthwith? Heck yeah! What are we waiting for? Let's go right now. Um, yes. Do you think maybe you're being a little too eager? Do people ever tell you that? Although, I do appreciate the enthusiasm. Now, follow me, yes? I'll have us at the cavern faster than you can say. <laughs> Is this pinnacle of cuteness I'm traveling with? Point me at, which is to say, off we go. I'm gonna help those people so dang hard. Right, here we are. Deep in this cavern, we'll find the greedy guts that consumed all the raw lens. So, let's go slay ourselves a monster.
No slacking, Cullies! Ha <laughs> ha! Looks like we'll reach the back of the cavern soon. Oh yes, this is definitely the place. Uh, the, the seal is intact, that's good. I'll just uh, quietly pat myself on the back for that one. Sorry, what do you mean? Huh? Oh, uh, nothing, nothing. <laughs> On we go! Hmm, so it seems... This is where the experiment took place. I thought for certain we'd have stumbled upon that greedy gobbler by now. Perhaps they fed me some tall tale. In which case, I'm absolved. Not that a perfect cutie like myself would err in the first place. Um, Momo, would you mind telling me what's really going on here? The secret to perfect cuteness? Oh, that's quite impossible. I mean, where to begin? No, I don't mean that. I... Um, what's happening? I'm gonna walk all over you!
Detroit smashed! and cutest of them all now. Oh, that's right. It's still me. <sighs> what was that all about? And how in the world did you get a cannon in here? Well, schnookums, now that I've recovered the raw lens I activated and undone my little boo-boo, I suppose I can tell you. My name is Moriarty Gardestein, and I'm the greatest sorcerer of my age. Centuries of intense magical study have shaped me into the vision of delight that stands before you. This cavern is one of many research stations I once created, although I had to abandon it due to a little mishap. Okay. <laughs> Poor dear. Your mind must be swimming. It's not often one stands before such a great and powerful sorcerer. So, let me get this straight. You're a cute little girl on the outside, but a centuries-old super mage on the inside? <gasps> Wrong! Oh, so you were exaggerating about the centuries part? Wrong again. And I'm no cute little girl, thank you. But I thought you liked being called cute. You kept saying as much. No, I mean I'm a boy, silly Billy. Oh. Oh! Um, sorry about before. I didn't mean to jump to any conclusions. Nor should you. When the world is full of so many wonder schnookums. Now, shall I let you in on a very special secret? Okay. Now, listen carefully. Because I have to whisper. It took me centuries of intense research to learn this secret. Which means it's for your ears alone. Are you ready? Um... Here it is. Cuteness triumphs over all. <laughs> the silence of ultimate comprehension. Yeah, sure. All I know is that Magic as great as yours goes way over my head. Give it time, Schnookums. One day you'll understand. Now, I believe I'll make myself comfortable at your humble abode. Excuse me? <gasps> you think I didn't know about that rough, tough alliance you lead, Cupcake? What you need is my magic and impeccable cuteness to guide your army to victory. <laughs> I'll have your every enemy just dying in capitulation. Um, thanks, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> 